हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज द सॉल्यूशन वीडियो फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव चैप्टर सिक्स एस सी वर्मा द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट सेज सपोज द एंटायर सिस्टम ऑफ द प्रीवियस क्वेश्चन इज केप्ट इन साइड एन एलिवेटर विच इज कमिंग डाउन विद एन एक्सेलरेशन ए लेस देन जी रिपीट पार्ट्स ए एंड बी सो दिस प्रॉब्लम इज द एक्सटेंशन ऑफ द प्रीवियस प्रॉब्लम सो इफ यू हैवेंट सीन द प्रीवियस वीडियो यू कैन क्लिक ऑन दिस लिंक अबव एंड यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड वॉट वॉज द सिचुएशन इन द क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फोर नाउ इन the same system is kept in a elevator and the elevator is coming down with an acceleration a right so in that scenario the only impact of this elevator is on the vertical forces acting on these blocks there will be no impact on the horizontal forces right so let's figure out what all forces are acting on the vertical direction right so first of all we will draw the fbd of a right so for block a the mg force will act downward tension t is in the string in the right hand direction the applied force will be f the reaction force is r and there it will be a pseudo force which is in the effect of motion of the lift in the downward direction so if the lift is moving in the downward direction with an acceleration a so that means there is a pseudo force will act on this block in the upward direction with an value of m into a okay now from the previous problem this force is additionally acting on this block okay so now as we done in the previous problem for case 1 and 2 we'll do the same thing so first of all for the vertical forces r plus ma minus mg is equal to 0 so that means r is equal to mg minus ma right the frictional force will act in the right hand direction because the force is try to pull this in the left hand direction that was say let's it is fr right so this fr will be mu times r or we can say mu times m times g minus a okay now in the horizontal motion we know the equation as f minus t minus fr is equal to 0 because in the first case the system should be in equilibrium or in rest right so i'll put the value of fr f minus t minus mu m g minus a is equal to 0 now from the fbd of block b this is the block b the total mass m plus m g will act downward the reaction force is in upward direction t is in the right hand direction and there will be a frictional force on the upper surface is fr right now for this one the pseudo force will be acting in the upward direction which is m into a now for the horizontal forces we can say that t minus fr is equal to 0 or t is equal to fr the value of fr is mu times m times g minus a so this t will become mu m g minus a now putting the value of t in this equation this will become f is equal to 2 times mu m g minus a so that means this is the maximum force which can be applied on block a such that they will be in equilibrium right so this is the solution for case 1 now for case 2 if this force is doubled now we have to find the acceleration of these two blocks okay so for that let's say fbd of block a now in this scenario the force is doubled tension t acting right hand direction frictional force the reaction the pseudo force and the mg force downward right so this time the horizontal forces will become 2f minus t minus fr is equal to m times acceleration right we know the value of fr 
we know the value of capital F we will try to figure out first of all the value of T that we can find out from the FBD of B so in this case tension T FR M plus MG the reaction and the pseudo force so from here this will become T minus FR is equal to M times A the value of FR is mu mg minus A now putting the value of that so the value of T will become T is equal to MA plus FR right the value of FR is mu mg minus A so this will become MA plus mu mg minus A now putting the value of T F and FR in this equation so this will become 2 times 2 mu m g minus a minus t that means m a plus mu m g minus a minus f r is mu m g minus a is equal to m a now if we'll solve this so this will become 4 mu m g minus a minus m a minus mu m g minus a minus mu m g minus a is equal to m a so the value of acceleration will become 2 mu m g minus a upon m plus m so this is the solution of this problem